Rise and grind, baby. Man, this is the perks of waking up early, I tell you what. Today, my recovery score is not good, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna option route. Instead of training chest and back, I'm just gonna break it down, do back, butt. Today, I'm gonna deadlift. And that's a big controversy, right? Deadlifts, as far as the risk to reward, that whole thing. I'm gonna touch on that, gonna go into detail on my opinions on it, but I have a ton of other exercises that I'm gonna recommend. It's gonna be all about blowing up the back. Plus, the full workout and alternative options are gonna be posted on IG subs. So check it out, subscribe on there. I've been getting some good feedback. To support the channel, please drop me a like, leave me a comment, say what's up. It's gonna be an awesome video. Let's get it, baby. Undisputed, if you want to build the back with one exercise, the conventional deadlift is number one. I mean, it's number one. Number two, I'm going to show you in a second, but I don't recommend deadlifts for most people, right? You want to make sure your form is number one. That should be your only focus throughout any rep. But man, everything, full back activation. I attribute most of my back gains to deadlifts. It's basically a cheat sheet, just deadlift, and you can build a massive back, but you have to be cognizant of the risk involved. So there are workarounds. Let me show you some exercises, but building your strength with some lower rep schemes and then getting volume hypertrophy with higher reps like I just did, you light it up. So that's the way to go, baby. Let's keep it rolling. That's number two, top two exercises, conventional deadlift and the pull-up. It's a primitive exercise that you can do anytime, any place, anywhere. You can get a doorway pull-up bar and pull up your back. You got the pull-downs too, but I'm partial to actual pull-ups. I think they're fantastic. No matter what you're doing, if you're an athlete, if you're a bodybuilder, pull-ups are beneficial. You can adjust the grips accordingly. So if you're not doing pull-ups, that I can recommend wholeheartedly. Whereas deadlifts, you have to know the risk that you're assuming if you're doing them and perfect the form. Likewise with the pull-up, nail the form, know what you're doing, get the mind muscle going, and you'll blow up your back. Another primitive, basic, amazing exercise that you cannot live without. It's the close grip cable row. Timeless, phenomenal. Back thickness, deadlifts, pull-ups, close grip cable row. You can build an amazing physique with any one of those alone, but with just the three of those combined, you got some magic. Fantastic alternative to a deadlift. If you're looking to avoid doing them, the glute ham raise, these babies, fill that up the whole posterior chain. Start with body weight, nail the form on these, then you can work your way up. It's like anything, dial the form in flawlessly, feel the mind muscle connection where you're supposed to, and you can run it up. If you want to go the route where you're building a physique without deadlifting, I highly recommend these. 
All right, hope you got some good ideas from this video. Full write-ups with varieties, option routes, other exercises you could do are on IG subs. Check it out. 300 likes, and I will dive into a snowbank on the next video, guaranteed, but it's gotta be by then. So uh, drop me a like, <laughs> leave me a comment, say what's up. Appreciate all the support, and I'll see you on the next one.